Hello gorgeous girls and sexy boys. I was looking for new paints to use for nail art and I found these. They are mica based iridescent watercolour paints. They were in my local craft store and cost £14 for eight. I thought they would work the same as acrylic paint but I ended up discovering a cool new effect instead. Here's what I did with it. For the effect to work properly, the base colour has to be completely dry. COMPLETELY DRY. Stroke a big wet brush through the pot a few times to pick up some of the paint. And simply paint it onto the nail. I think the effect looks absolutely mental almost like condensation or morning dew. If the drips are too big, wipe some excess water off the brush so the paint is more concentrated. You can keep dabbing over the design until you're satisfied with the coverage. I think iridescent pink and yellow look fabulous over black. This dries in about 10 minutes, so top coat as normal to make it pop even more. Now I obviously had to try out this effect in rainbow. With these paints you have to wipe off the brush thoroughly between colours because it's very clingy, like an annoying ex-boyfriend. So that's it. Condensation, morning dew, splattery, drippy, colourful, iridescent nails. They'd be an awesome background for some badass designs, or for when you want some shocking new trendy fingertips and you don't have an hour to create a nail art design. Cause crackle is so five minutes ago. It's harder to remove than normal nail polish, but easier to remove than glitter, and it didn't do any harm to my nails, so I'd recommend it to everyone. I don't know if other things would create this effect, I'm not an expert as I discovered this completely by accident. Again, these are mica based iridescent watercolour paints. If you try this out or get the same effect with different materials, let me know of your successes or fails in a comment or video response. Or you can come and share your sexy nails on my Facebook page. I know I went to hardcore nail school, but you guys still inspire me immensely and I learn new things from everyone. Thanks for watching and be experimental. What's the worst that could happen? Your fingers could fall off? They probably won't though. Bye!